farmworld.tv is the place to find independent agri-documentaries from Jörn and Tamo Glaser. So far, we have joined farmers and agricultural contractors at work in 25 different countries across five continents to show and explain how agricultural production is unique in each corner of the world. Here, on YouTube, we introduce you to regular short stories that offer you a glimpse into our work and everything we love about agriculture. We have visited Guria's agricultural contractors based near Hanover in northern Germany many a time with our cameras over the last 15 years to film them for our productions. In this second short film, we bring you some footage from the grass harvest as well as a construction site. The first cut of grass silage starts around the 25th of April. Depending on the weather situation, farmers call gurias from a few days up to a few hours before they want to harvest. For around 14 days, this means full speed ahead for the team of agricultural contractors to serve all their customers on time. There are around 80 hectares of grass to chop on the fields of this dairy farm north of Hanover. It needs to be finished in one day. Guriers have already been to prepare the fields for this customer using the Big M420 and a large area rake. One of their four Krona harvesters, an 1100 and a 770 Big X, stand at the ready for the grass harvest. Their favourite is the 770. This is equipped with a 28 blade drum. Most customers ask for a chop length of 15 millimeters. It is only ever driven with a full set of blades. The harvester is fired by a 775 horsepower V8 MAN engine with a 16 liter cylinder capacity. Four sets of tractors with trailers are used to cart the silage, three of which use simple silage trailers. On the back of the Fent 826 is a ZX forage wagon. For this customer, it is used to pick up silage on fields with shorter distances, whereas for longer distances, the ZX is also used to support the harvester. The extreme drought of spring 2018 has had very few noticeable effects on the first cut of grass forage so far. In terms of quality and yield, the harvest is satisfactory. It becomes a problem at the second cut. Some farmers lose out on it completely due to the lack of rainfall. Normally, Guria's harvests up to five cuts of grass forage for its customers using forage harvesters, forage wagons and balers. On the silo, team member Lars is rolling with the New Holland T7315. With a three-ton additional weight, as well as the silage separator, the roller tractor gets up to 15 tons. Gurias used to rely on wheel loaders to roll the silage. Due to the high mileage clocked up by the wheel loaders and their clear focus on maize harvest contracts, they have now completely switched to tractors. As promised, we now follow the Gurias team to another contract. We're going to a construction site in an industrial park near Bergwedel in the Hanover region of Germany. Here we meet long-standing team member Bjorn once again, who we shadowed in part one. Three dumper trailers have been hired for the transportation work from construction company fields at Languth. 5,000 cubic meters are to be moved in three days for this contract. The dumper trailers are being loaded by two excavators. This caterpillar is almost 20 years old already and has 140 horsepower. Using a laser, the exact depth and contours of the terrain are monitored during the excavation work. The excavated earth is transported to a nearby field. 
a 140 horsepower dozer from Languth stands at the ready for the leveling work. Despite being built in 1984, the machine still does a good job. Guriers have over five diggers of their own, up to a charge weight of 23 tons. Subcontracting work with multiple companies working together is very common in the construction business. For their own jobs on motorway construction sites, or even at Hanover Airport, the Guriers team is booked out along with a multitude of vehicles for weeks at a time. Guriers have been offering the dumper service for four years now. Meanwhile, eight of these 13 cubic meter dumpers from Metaltech have been put into service. MD Dirk Guriers rates the vehicles due to their robust fabrication and their split axles. This ensures exceptionally good cross-country mobility and stability during tipping. Guria's agricultural contractors have a total of 10 Case IH Puma 220 tractors in their fleet. These tractors have been tried and tested, pulling both silage trailers and dumper trailers. With the help of the power boost feature, these tractors can get up to a maximum engine power of 260 horsepower. Three new Big X 1100 forage harvesters go off on their first MEDGE silage contract. We will be there with our cameras too. If you like our film productions, then take a look at our website, www farmworld.tv. This is where you can watch all of our in-depth documentaries about farming and farm machinery worldwide.